Here's challenge 34. If I launch the marbles, they go right here. Our goal is to get all these stars with the marbles. The stars are just outside of these two ellipses. So let's find the equations of these ellipses. X minus H squared plus Y minus K squared equals one. So this is a circle. And then in order to make it an ellipse, we divide the X side by the X radius squared, and we divide the Y side by the Y radius squared. So this is the formula right here. H, K is our center. So our center of the ellipse here is gonna be negative six, zero. So if I plug plug in negative six for H, I make that a plus six, and I plug in zero for the K. That's now gonna be centered right here. Next, the radius in the X direction is two. So I'm gonna make this a four down here. And the radius in the Y direction is about a three. So I'm gonna make this a nine down here. So now we pretty much have this ellipse right here. Then to get the other ellipse, I'll copy this formula and its center is at nine, negative five. So we'll say minus nine. And then in the Y, we'll say plus five. And now we're exactly right there. The marbles drop right here. I'm thinking that if we expand the ellipse to around here and then cut it and then expand this ellipse around here and cut it, then the marbles might do this. Go through here and then catch in here and go through here. That's what I'm thinking we should try. First, to expand it in the X direction, I'm gonna increase this four, make it a 10. This nine, I'm gonna make it a 12. Let's do the same thing for these down here. Let's go 10 and 12. I wanna cut this first one about right here. So we'll say Y is less than, the slope is probably about negative one and we'll move it down two. That looks just about right. So if I paste this restriction into here, everywhere this purple will still be defined, but everywhere that's white is gonna disappear. So I'll plug that in right here. And now we just took a bite out of that ellipse. So I bet if we hit launch, it'll get caught in there. Cool. Now we just need to work on this other ellipse. I wanna cut this other ellipse like right there. So it looks like a steeper slope. We'll say Y is less than two X. And then we wanna drop that down quite a bit. That might work right there. But once again, everywhere that's red will stick around and everything that's white is gonna disappear. And I'll plug that into here. Squiggle marks means a restriction. And then that is where I drop my restriction. Now let's try this out. Oh. So that was really close. We just got to make this a little bit bigger in the Y direction. So maybe we should try 16. Okay, let's make this one a little bit bigger in the Y direction too. Let's go 14 for that. There we go. Cool. How exciting.